So welcome to the general quiz prelims at Patna Mindfest 2023 brought to you by the research team at Nexus Consulting. We are based in Bangalore and do work across the country. Please look us up on our social media platforms. Lots of our older quizzes are available on YouTube as videos. You can follow us on Twitter for announcements of upcoming quizzes and on Instagram for a question a day. The Indica quiz book is available for sale. We are giving a special discount at Patna Mindfest. Uh, if you buy it on Amazon, it is rupees 349. We are giving it to you at a 100 rupee discount here today at rupees 249. You can come and order it here and we will ship you the books tomorrow. Okay. And if you follow us on Instagram, you get a question a day uh, or uh, an interesting fact every day that you can keep tracking at Fun with Fundas. A big shout out and thank you to our organizers and sponsors. To begin with, the IS Officers Association of Bihar who has put this entire thing together, Dr. Vivek Singh and his team, whose brainchild this is. The wonderful Bihar Museum for giving us this fantastic venue. Extra C, the team that is revolutionizing crosswords and extracurricular activities in India. BSACs, our three banking supporters, HDFC Bank, SBI and Union Bank of India, thank you very much for your financial support. Uh, UMSAS Patna, who uh, if you can see their, uh, their advertisement outside, wonderful crafts and arts from all over Bihar. And Biada, thank you very much. Uh, without all these sponsors, this would not be possible. Right. Once again, please put mobile phones on silent mode. Put them away in your bags or pockets. Please don't take out your phone on any account during the prelims. You will be disqualified without. Before we begin, a small uh, little acknowledgement to be done. Question number one. We start again with the local question. This is the tomb of Hassan Khan blank designed by Aliwal Khan. It is located in Sasaram in Bihar. This town served as the capital of a dynasty from 1530 to 1540 until a lion king moved it to Delhi. The name of which dynasty fills in the blank? It's a short blank. Yeah, who wants to try? Let, on the back. Yes. Magad? Not Magad. Suri, that's the right answer. This is Hasan Khan Suri, the father of Sher Shah Suri. Suri. Next. Let's go to question number two. What art form, generally considered a nuisance by authorities, comes from an Italian word meaning scratched? These artworks can usually be seen in public spaces. Yeah, what art form is this? Lots of hands raised. Yes. Graffiti. That's correct. Graffiti. Graffiti comes from the Italian word for scratched. Next. Question three. Photographer Sean Botterill is ironically not on a particular social media platform. He was near a person when this person lifted a prized possession that he had chased his entire career. The resulting photo ended up cracking the record that had been held by a certain Eugene. What world record did Sean Botterill's photo establish? What world record are we talking about? I'll come to you guys for the tougher questions. Wait. Yes. Most liked photo on Instagram. This is, what is the photo? Messi lifting up the World Cup trophy. Correct. And your clue was, cracked was a clue to get to the fact that the previous one was an egg called Eugene. So, Messi lift, lifting up the trophy. Most liked picture on Instagram. We need that for points. Okay. Let's move on. Question 4. Pictured here, you will see on the next slide, is actor Jitu Kamal. In a 2022 film, he portrayed someone who was an illustrator, author, calligrapher, and music composer, among other things. Who did he portray in this film? We need that person's full name. Okay, who's Jitu Kamal playing in this film? Yes. Satyajit Ray. That's the right answer. There's a beautiful movie called Aparajito, which is on the making of Pater Panchali. Satyajit Ray. Correct. Next. Let's move to five. Vladimir Putin was a member of the KGB, which is the Russian secret service, secret police, for 15 years. From 1985 to 1990, he was stationed in a different country. 
goods banned in the USSR were smuggled into through this puppet state and black money raised for war efforts were funneled here. Which erstwhile of former country, you need, your answer needs to have two words, was he posted in? So that country in that form does not exist anymore. Okay, which erstwhile country? East Germany. East Germany. Well done. East Germany is correct. East Germany. Next. Okay. Number six. This cricketer won the player of the tournament award at the recently concluded Women's T20 World Cup. During the WPL auction, she was purchased for INR 3.2 crores. This is the highest amount paid for a foreign player in the WPL. A record she jointly holds with Natalie Siver Brunt. Which player is being talked about? This one's a little bit of a toughie. But we want all of you to also follow women's cricket, apart from following the IPL and the men's cricket team. So this question is one endeavor in that direction. Who is this player? Yeah, who is this cricketer after all the clues I gave? Yes. Only with your clue, it's Ashley Gardner. Ashley Gardner, that's correct. It is Ashley Gardner of Australia. Ashley Gardner plays for Gujarat Giants in the WPL. Let's move to seven. During mid-March 2023, Malayala Manorama, a daily from Kerala, published an article about something in the news at the time. The article featured a step-by-step -step guide on how to do something and said that following the steps would make it easy for one to do this because they have complicated movements done very quickly. What were these steps about? Here is a very useful image. What were these steps given for? Okay, what are these steps about? Very easy. Yes. Nato, Nato. Correct. These are the Nato, Nato dance steps. Well done. Moving to eight. Blank, this company, unveiled a new logo to reflect its transition from a phone company to a technology leader. The logo features a modern design and includes the removal of strokes from the letters N and A and the stem from the letter K. The new logo has five shapes that form the word blank with the iconic blue shade replaced by different colors. Which famous company is this? In the past, the logo has featured a salmon as a reference to the river by which they first started. Okay, which company unveiled this new logo? Nokia, yes. Somebody shouted out Nokia. Lippincott, this is the new Nokia logo. Question nine. Okay. No, interesting video. Let's watch the video. Please give sound. So, this is a, a special music video called Number Stories by Netflix to help boost its viewership for South Indian content. This is the Malayalam section of it. It's powered by Neeraj Madhav. He's rapping about the brilliance of his home state. So you can say that he says various things. And at one point he says, cent percent literacy, blank blanks, English proficiency. Which famous person's name fills in the blanks? He has introduced the general public to several obscure English words. And he is originally from Kerala. Yeah, whose name fills in the blanks? Shashi Tarur, correct. Shashi Tarur, current member of parliament from Tiruvannandapuram constituency. Shashi Tarur. Okay. Number 10. At age of 40, this person, this personality took up painting as a respite from depression. He made more than 500 artworks during his lifetime. However, the one that you'll see, titled Tower of Kutubia Mosque, was the only one he made between 1939 and 1945. Because he was otherwise very busy between 1939 and 1945. Which famous political figure made this artwork? This is the painting. He is not a painter. He is a famous leader of a country. Right? Yeah, who is this political figure? Yes. Winston Churchill, that's the right answer. He also won the Nobel Prize for Literature. This is Winston Churchill who started painting as well. Next, let's go to Levin. Interest in this brand shot up in early 2023 after someone said that it was his mother's favorite perfume. 
He described using it during therapy. At the start of our session, he lifted the lid, took a deep sniff, like a tab of LSD. I read somewhere that smell is our oldest sense, and that fitted with what I experienced in that moment. The mother is a very, very famous lady who is unfortunately not alive anymore because she died very young. The son who's talking is also a very important person, and he released a book last year as well. Both of them are very important, well-known people. Easy one, I think. Yes. Princess Diana or you can say Prince Harry. Yeah, either is fine. Either Princess Diana or Prince Harry. Okay, let's go to 12. The first pet to be cloned was born in 2001. Now, this is not Dolly the sheep, right? This is the first pet to be cloned. Although the genetic material had been donated by something or someone called Rainbow, the clone grew her own distinct patterns and personality. Think about what is the animal or the pet that was cloned and therefore tell me what alliterative name was given to the cloned pet. Alliterative name means the two words both have to start with the same letter. right? One, There are two possible answers that we will accept, two possible two word answers. One of those you can figure out if you think about the various fields that you use when you are writing an email and given that it is cloned. So that is one way to get it. Or you can figure out what animal this is and given the fact that it was cloned, think of a common phrase. So if you think, for example, that this is a, a dog, right? Your answer has to be something dog. And that, that those two words by themselves are a phrase or words that are well known. Think of it in the context of cloning. I need a two word answer. One of the words is what type of animal it is. The other is another word. But you can give me an alternate answer which doesn't involve the name of the animal as well. That is the email answer. That is also okay. Okay, let's see who gets this one right. Uh, you guys have already tried. You have already tried. Yes. Carbon copy. Carbon copy is one acceptable answer. There you go. The other acceptable answer is copycat. Yeah. We'll give you for either carbon copy, which was the email clue, CC carbon copy, or copycat. That's also fine. So let's move on to 13. Archaeologists Henry Cousins and James Burgess visited this place in the 1890s when it was completely buried under silt and only the shaft and few pillars were visible. A 1304 composition of a Jain monk named Merutunga mentions that Queen Udayamati built this from 1963. What note India are we talking about? Okay, which notable structure? Someone new try. Yeah. Rani Ki Vav, absolutely right. Rani Ki Vav, it's on the 100 rupee note. That's why notable and Queen Udayamati, so Rani Ki Vav. Question 14. Train coaches are being used as shelters to house the survivors of February 2023 disaster. Survivors of which disaster are using these shelters? There you go. Lots of clues in the picture. Okay, which disaster? Easy one. Earthquake, earthquake in Turkey. Earthquake in Turkey or Syria. That's correct. Either Turkey or Syria and earthquake. India had also sent an army medical team, NDRF. 15. Most Indian railway stations have a three or four letter station code. One of the most interesting station codes is that of a planned city in central India. The city itself is named for an individual and its station code is in reference to an entity he founded. What is the four letter station code that you might also hear when someone says goodbye? Okay, people have slowly figured it out. Good. What's the answer? Tata, correct. Jamshedpur railway station code is Tata. Okay, 16. It happened to 250 named characters in 74 different ways. Scholar and chemist Catherine Harkup examines them all in her 2020 book, Blank by Blank, Snake Bite, Stabbings and Broken Hearts. The book has insights into forensic pathology, history of medicine and such topics while detailing how all these characters met their end. 
what is the title of the book? Okay, this one will get a chocolate. Uh, let's go to someone who hasn't tried. Yes. Excellent answer. Here, take a chocolate. Death by Shakespeare. Absolutely right. Death by Shakespeare. Okay. 17. Kate Winslet holds the world record for holding a breath underwater during the shooting of a film sequence. She did this for 7 minutes and 15 seconds, breaking the record previously held by Tom Cruise. For which 2022 film was this sequence shot? Image. There you go. Okay, which 2022 film? Easy one. Yes. Avatar 2. You can say Avatar 2 or Avatar Way of Water. That's fine. Avatar 2 or Avatar Way of Water. Question number 18. The story of Blix and Blee was an advertisement in the form of a children's book featuring the titular L's. The comic was created to show how a family should use a particular product on their child. It's a product that exists even today. Right? It's a brand that exists even today. What brand? Two word answer. So it says his mother and his grandma had tried everything but they knew all their efforts came to naught for all the medicine they bought. With howls of rage he pushed aside and simply would not open wide. His father tried to hold his head but only spilled it on the bed. Alas, then everybody there just wrung their hands and tore their hair. The family and the folks next door could think of nothing more to stop the cough or ease the pain. Then the mother sobbed at Dickie's side and loud as loud she cried, we need some help and need it quick. Oh, who will save my darling Dick? Now, after this, one particular product or brand is shown. Yep, let's see if anybody's gotten this one. Yes? Excellent answer. Here you go. Vix Vapor Rub is correct. Vix Vapor, not inhaler. The ad was for Vix Vapor Rub. But if somebody has written Vix, you give them half. Vix Vapor Rub will get you the full points. Pro that's, you are saying the exact inverse thing. Procter & Gamble is the company. Vix Vapor Rub is the brand. We asked for the brand. Procter & Gamble will not get you points. Procter & Gamble owns 70, 100 brands in its portfolio. Okay. Let's go to the next question. 19. In the movie Glass Onion and Knives Out Mystery, Daniel Craig's character Benoit Blanc is, Blanc is depressed at having to, to stay home during the COVID-19 pandemic. To engage himself and to keep his detective skills fresh, he along with a few friends engaged in an online game that was very popular during the early stages of the pandemic. What online game inspired by party games such as Mafia is he seen playing? Yeah, what online game? Easy one. Uh, let's go to somebody young. Yes. Among Us. Correct. Among Us. Inner slots. Among Us. Last question before we go to the stars. Number 20. Okay. Let's play the video. Every year we make a certain weight of goods out of copper, more out of aluminum, and then you have glass, asphalt, lime, iron is a big one for all the steel, and then there's ceramic and wood. But by far, the solid product we make the most of is material, essentially. We use as much of it as we do all other materials combined. And it's easy to see why. Yeah, so that video is basically telling you that every year, for the needs of human beings, several materials are used to for various things. So. You saw all of that stuff there, iron and asphalt and lime and all that. But by far the item that is used the most is this. Okay, what is being talked about in this video? Concrete, very good, or cement. You can say either cement or concrete, not clay bricks. Either cement or concrete, Con cementious, cementitious material or concrete. The dome of the Parthenon is the largest reinforced, con unreinforced concrete building in the world. Okay. Next. Okay. We go to the last five questions. These are two pointers. So please write your answers with a comma in between. So that it's easier. And also remember that each question carries two stars. So there are 10 stars overall. Great power involves great responsibility, as said by Franklin D. Roosevelt, was felt by me when I chaired the blank blank session. 
I hope to create milestones as I undertake this journey with the trust and faith vested in me by my people. This is a statement from a former international athlete who represented India at the global stage. Who is this athlete? It's a lady. Right? What is she referring to? Because she got the opportunity to chair a session at a very, very important thing in India. You may be confused about two possible answers for the blanks. Uh, you can pick the right one by knowing that both blank lengths are the same. Think about chairing a session which is like super important in India. What type of session would you be chairing? Or where, you know, why would it be so, so much responsibility? And if you're, if you're doubt, there are two possible answers. If you're doubtful about the two, pick the one where both the words are of similar length. Yeah, who is this and what was she talking about at the back? And PT Usha and Rajya Sabha session, absolutely right. Chairing the Rajya Sabha. P.T. Usha and Rajya Sabha. There you go. Okay. Yeah, what two answers, what items make up the 974 stadium? Let's do one by one. Yes. 22. Okay, this should be easy. There are two stadiums that had been used during the... These are two stadiums that had been used during the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. One of them is, sta is named Stadium 974 in reference to the 974 items it was made from. Also the fact that Qatar's international dialing code was 974. The other is the Al Bayt Stadium inspired by something commonly used in the region. So two questions. Question number one, first image. What items make up the 974 stadium? First, first image please. Yeah. So the entire stadium was made using 974 items, 974 numbers of a particular item. What item? An appropriate item, given that Qatar is located where it's located. Look at the background, everything as well. Coming to the second part. First part, what items made up the 974 stadium? Second part, what does the Al Bayt stadium look like? What does the look of the stadium supposed to be inspired by? Something, it's an object that is commonly found and used by people in that region. Not steel frame. Shipping containers is correct. And what is the look of the Albaid stadium inspired by? Not mountains. Not headgear. Bedouin tents. That's the right answer. Tents will get you points. Tents will do. That's fine. We'll give it to you. If the order is interchanged, doesn't matter. Because you can't build the stadium with tents anyway. Shipping containers and tents. There are other, other stadiums that is for a different stadium. Other stadiums, other design elements of the stadiums, other stadiums include the Dhau, which is the boat, and the skull cap worn by Muslims. The al is inspired by the tents. Okay. Moving it on, 23. The blank blank is a 2021 biography on the life of a scientist who made pioneering contributions in CRISPR gene editing. Hence the title of the work. A 2011 documentary about the individual scene also uses the exact same title. What is the title of the biography or the documentary? Two words, first word four letters, second word seven letters. Who is the personality picture? This is the personality, very famous scientist from England. Who is this personality? Ah, uh, yes, who wants to? Yes, Code Breaker and Alan Turing, absolutely right. Code Breaker and Alan Turing. This book is by Walter Isaacson, who's also written the biography of Steve Jobs and several others. About Nobel Prize awardee Jennifer Doudna who did the CRISPR gene editing breakthrough, Code Breaker and Alan Turing. Okay. Let's go to 24, penultimate question of the prelims. 
This gentleman appeared in KBC in 2022 and had to answer this question that we had set. What is the name of the chart with letters in multiple rows used for an eye test? To his great embarrassment and unfortunately, he did not know the answer. Who is the person? Which company did he start? Yeah, who is this? And Lenskart, yes. Payush Bansal and Lenskart. Please give her the chocolate once you pick it up. Payush Bansal, just Bansal will do and Lenskart. And the last question, you can shout out. Yeah, so who is this person? Which company did he start? Okay. Last question. Okay, let's listen to the audio. Hope you enjoyed that. This is a style of music that's a fusion genre that combines Bhojpuri folk music with Caribbean styles like Calypso. In the early part of the 2010s, Neha Kanwalkar went to places like Trinidad to help create tracks like this. What is such music called? It's a food item. One word, seven letters. Fill up the type of music, first part. Second part for which 2012 film, three words. Was she doing this? Again, appropriate question to kind of end the prelims. Chutney music, Gangs of Vasepur. That is correct. The Hunter song in Gangs of Vasepur and Chutney music. Okay, these are the answers. We will start the finals.